you design sensors to detect someone's presence or proximity, it is clear that today's sensing technology can present some challenges in applications like building automation, consumer, white goods, automotive, and more. Hi everyone, I'm Maurizio Gavardoni from Texas Instruments in Silicon Valley. To implement proximity sensing, capacity sensing has many advantages over traditional optical and infrared sensors. Capacitive sensing uses very low cost and flexible sensors. Since it has no contacts, it is very reliable. It is unaffected by ambient light and can detect the presence of black and dark objects. And also, it can sense through the material, thus avoiding drilling holes in the sensing product. Up until now, capacitive sensing has not been used for proximity sensing because of false triggering due to various sources of interference such as noise and EMI generated by lights, cellular phones, radios, and motors. Well, now TI has solved this problem by developing an innovative new generation of noise immune 28 bits capacitance to digital converter products that is revolutionizing the field of proximity sensing. The FTC 2214 cap sensing family of converter products is unique and it's the industry's first noise immune capacitive sensing solution. The FTC 2214 family enables capacity sensing applications like long-range human body sensing and liquid level sensing in a real-world environment with interferences like fluorescent lights, radio signals, motor noise, and other sources of EMI or noise. And TI's FTC family of products offer you noise performance that no other existing solution today can achieve up to more than 60 times better than existing capacity sensing solutions. Let me show you an example of how this unique technology from TI works. What we see here is an evaluation module for the FTC 2214. The evaluation board has the FTC 2214 converter, an MCU like the MSP430, two sensors, and it's perforated so you can customize it to your own sensing solution. Using one of the two sensors on the board connected to this laptop and running a GUI, we can do a quick demonstration of proximity sensing. You can see that as my hand approaches the sensor, the measure capacitance increases. And as you may notice how sensitive this device is. Now take a look at this enhanced version of the EVM that looks like a capacity sensing board they may be using in a refrigerator display. When I stand in front of it, it recognizes my presence and it turns the LED on. When I back away, the LED turns off. So you can see that this family of products from TI is revolutionary and industry leading in capacitive sensing. It's one of a kind noise immune architecture allows you to design using capacitive sensing for proximity measurements, even in the presence of interference which has not been possible with existing CAP sensing architectures. You can get much more information at ti.com slash CAP sensing, including a set of proven reference designs in our TI designs library that can help you get started on your next capacitive sensing design. You'll also get access to our WebEnch online design tools, evaluation modules, and other resources, including our TI E2E designers community forum. So check it out and take advantage of this breakthrough sensing technology from TI. That will wrap up things for now, and thanks for watching.